Hi, I'm Liz Murphy with PICO, and we are thrilled to be sponsoring Go Forth and Learn. It's part of the Wawa Welcome America Festival. At PICO, we know that learning never stops, so we put our energy into learning and exploring with you all week long in the comfort and safety of your home. Please enjoy and thank you. Hey there, Philadelphia. I'm Sergeant Major Erica Russo, Director of Operations for the U.S. Army Field Band outside Baltimore, Maryland. I'm so pleased to be with you today. I've been in the Army for just about 19 years now, and I'm proud to have this opportunity to follow the example of my grandmother. She decoded enemy secrets during World War II as a cryptographer, and she taught me so much about how to take care of a family and how to be a leader. I strive to follow her example every day, how to be strong when it's necessary, how to listen to others, how to take care of the soldiers I serve with and whom I represent. The story I'm gonna read you today is one I've read with both of my kids, but especially my son, who sometimes has a rough day or sometimes just needs an opportunity to calm down, especially if one of his favorite sports teams might not have been doing as well as he'd hoped. He is a Philadelphia Eagles fan. Anyway, the story I'm gonna read you is called How Do Dinosaurs Say I'm Mad? by Jane Yolen and Mark Teague. How does a dinosaur act when he's mad? Does he roar, slam the door, yell at mom or at dad? <gasps> when he can't get his way, does he boast, I'll be bad? Is that what dinosaurs say when they're mad? When Papa says no, does he grumble and pout? When Mama says no, does he throw toys about? When he's told to sit still, does he kick at a chair? Does he act as if mother and father aren't there? When he hears, take a nap, does he give dirty looks? When he's told, Quiet down, does he rip up his books? No cookies today? Fling a mug at the cat. Time for bed. Does he bang on the floor with his bat? No, a dinosaur doesn't. He counts up to 10, then after a time out, breathes calmly, and then he cleans up his mess, and he picks up the mug. He says, I am so sorry. He gives a big hug. His anger is gone. So he opens the door. Not mad. I'm so glad, little dinosaur. Thanks very much for the opportunity to be with you today. Have a great summer. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe and stay strong. All the best to you. Bye-bye.